It's November 23rd. Do you know what your novel is? Good morning, super cool party people. I thought that today I would talk a little bit about National Novel Writing Month because if you don't know, it's almost over but it's November it's National Novel Writing Month and I typically try to do it but I decided not to do it this year because I'm editing my book and in all fairness you can kind of like add any creative words to it so I could have just kept track of what I was doing and I definitely would have probably made the 50,000 words but it just felt like cheating to me because it's already mostly written I'm just going through and puttering here and there that being said, at the beginning of the month, it's like, if I finish editing soon enough in the month, maybe I'll still do it. But we're not there yet, so that's fine. But I have started National Mall Writing Month on the 20th of November and finished on the 28th. So it is possible. It's painful. It hurts. You don't sleep. But it is possible. But I decided, no, gotta finish this book. It's more important. So that's why I'm not doing National Mall Writing Month this year but I'm kind of sad about it because I've been doing it for like the past couple years in a row. Like last year I did 80,000 words. Super helpful. I always find it so productive and so helpful to be able to like look at that graph and be like, I gotta meet that graph at least. So yeah, but I'm not doing it this year because I just don't have time. And also I can't believe that it's almost the end of the month. Like this is crazy. Anyway, I just woke up. I got to sleep in today, which was nice. And um, now I'm gonna go putter about and start my day and then later on get into editing because that's what we do. So I will check in with you later. So it's like two o'clock and I feel like I've made no progress in the day. I just got out of bed. I was just laying there for like two hours watching YouTube videos. I did start writing though and then I came across a problem that is not timelines but it's names up. <clears throat> but it's names of cities. So I was like, Ugh. <laughs> and so I stopped. I blogged about it. Link down below. And um, now I'm sitting here watching some videos. I'm apparently struggling to breathe and I'm trying to write down city names, come up with them on the spot. So I'll have a list for later. So that's what I'm doing. It's exciting stuff. No progress forward. Well, there was a little bit, like a couple paragraphs, but yeah. <sighs> Bye. All right, so I'm watching Survivor again. It's a terrible decision because I just started a new season. But I did come up with some good names, which is super exciting, including a name for a place, like not a city, like an actual place that has been plaguing me, like in my story. It comes up in book two, but every time it shows up, it's just like blank and then in brackets what it is. So I'm, I'm really stoked with the progress I've made. I need to like finish watching this though. Um, looks like I've got about half an hour left and then I should get back into doing the thing that I was doing before which was being moderately productive so yeah I feel like today's a bit of a bust but that's fine it's only three we still got a lot of the day left so maybe we can turn it around freaking timelines it's always timelines if it's not names it's timelines um but it's so important but oh, timelines so taking a quick pause trying to figure out someone else's timeline uh, so I can make sure that I don't screw things up, but <sighs> note to self, and I'm sure I've said this before, write out your timeline next time before you start writing the book. It's not like the book timeline though, per se, it's like an external character's timeline, so I have to make sure it lines up with someone else's timeline or else it doesn't make sense. <sighs> My bed's also not made. Bad call probably, but it's fine. All right, well, it was bound to happen eventually, and I'm going to blame Survivor in large part for this, but I didn't get my two chapters done today. I got like a third of chapter 18 done. It's just like, because it's daunting. I am so tired right now, too. It's midnight. I don't know what I've done with my day. Pretty much nothing. I know I didn't vlog much, but that's also because I did nothing with my day. So, I bought a TV. It's right there. I need to hook it up with like my Wii U but I finally have a TV back in my room which will be nice so I can maybe play video games which is obviously not what I need because I don't need more distractions but it'll be good to have I think and it's only like a hundred bucks so I think that's a win <laughs> anyway with that I'm gonna go to sleep now I'm exhausted 
Uh, so thanks for coming along on today's adventure where I did nothing, and I will uh, see you tomorrow when I likely also do nothing, but maybe get two chapters done. <laughs>